everybody. When I hear from one of those eyes pouring my uh, pillow, and as usual, I try to put as as little as possible if I can. So now maybe this is already too much, um, it, even though it's gonna help. Um, I mean, if you have like three blooms, I think, you know, it helps that you have a good, um, a good, uh, not that thin of a layer, you know, underneath. <laughs> three blooms. I've done it before. I haven't shown the video yet. It was on a black uh, background. So now let's go ahead. Yeah, you guys, yeah, I have 47 minutes. I sometimes like to, let's start with the, with the one in the middle though. So I'm gonna do just three. So this is this lovely yellow, is um let's see what's the name for that okay indian yellow yeah i always love it indian yellow from Josonia. this is enough <laughs> that it's three three uh blooms so we're gonna be fine but it's just gonna be a lengthy video and also with the introduction this one is a spicy apricot um, gorgeous pigment from color art uh, primary elements look at that i mean these guys are just gorgeous this is one of my favorite also uh, just the camera now look at this spicy apricot and uh, but you know <laughs> uh, each time i say spicy apricot i want to just go and cook apricot in some spices okay so third layer i think actually i'm not as daring so let's see now Okay, what I'm gonna do here is, um, yeah, I'm gonna take this silver from, I hope I'm not ruining, ruining it, but silver is my, uh, yeah, I love, I love it, from Deco Art Americana. And this is, Bell iridescent blue green. Okay, I think I need more. What I don't know. Maybe it's already big. <laughs> so I have to really be do smaller ones. We'll see anyhow. And then again I'm gonna put a little bit. Maybe, maybe too much. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, and this is another pigment called Temptation from Color Art and Mother. It's really Temptation. Yum. Delish. So, guys, um, if you like to, you know, visit the website of colorarte.com and you get to see the actual colors uh, being mixed. I mean, yeah, you see the actual colors being mixed. Exactly like I said the first time. <laughs> I don't know, this color, this, this one, I feel it's quite thin. Even though I just say my, use the same poor medium. Anyhow, let's go ahead and this time I'm just gonna add 
green on top and this is emerald green from and so it's not really exactly the same colors but anyhow so the emerald green by amsterdam so like i said um yeah i want if you like to buy any of the products of color art you can use my uh, code mona rosa art all in small letters four two one and then you get 20 percent of your uh, purchase of so now it's been a long time since i actually done a bloom so i'll start with a black selectivator And then on top of that, copper. Details will be mentioned in um, description box as to the ratios and all that. Now, let's hope, guys. Well, we'll see. I had that. Oh, yeah. Well, you have a lot of uh, pillow cells, right? And I have island cells as well, in addition to the others. And I have beautiful colors. Wow. These ones here, the cells are gorgeous gorgeous i'll have to see that i don't lose them in the final process but now that you know you can see that i have a lot of pillow cells and this happens with uh gliden essential it's actually more so than i expected So, I used to do um, golden essentials, but with, I mean, semi-gloss, and I did get these white cells, pillow cells, Casper cells, um, but not, yeah, I mean, this is like a kind of too much. So anyhow, let's go ahead and try again, see if maybe... Um, maybe we get less of these white cells. Okay, so, okay, I just want to put a bit here. Maybe I shouldn't, maybe I shouldn't put a lot of white. Let's just see. Again, same order at this time i think i'm gonna use less of um of silver and let's see what we get This color is a beautiful, yet it's um, domineering. It took all the um, I mean, it's a domineering color, you know. So what I'm gonna do is um, I'm gonna actually uh, get. I'm gonna do something different this time. I'm going to put this green before and then get 
a bit of silver here. It's not a bit, but that's okay. I mean, I am happy with the result I get as long as it's decent. So, okay, now maybe this is too much. Let me just use this to kind of, you know, maybe get something also different or other colors. Okay, so now I'll also use less of the black. Just a tiny bit. I could see it took over. them are done and I love this one this one gorgeous I hope I don't lose it again with stretching okay so now we go to the third the third should be here and uh, because I need this I need a surface for this bloom so All right, so let's hope, guys. Let's put this here and let's go again. Oh, God, this is a bit far. So I want it closer to me. The thing is, uh, with this camera, I had, and for you guys to see, I have to be far from uh, where I'm working. I, I will I will have to find a different way. Okay, now we don't need a lot of paint here. So repeating again, spicy apricot. Just one tiny drop of. Well, we can actually three drops <laughs> and then the blue and then and this time I'm gonna do something different. Green, just basically on top of each other and, and then bit of and now yeah I think I should put my paints in the front of the air conditioner I always forget my apartment is hot, so my pants, even though I am sure of their consistency, when I come to paint, it they have cha they change. They become, you know, more of a liquid, more thin, thinner. Okay, maybe it's enough. Maybe not. Bye. 
bad, not bad. Not bad, right? We'll see now what happens. So now I think, you know, with this actually, I will be able to um, I don't know, shall I just, you know, just um, not tilt about through it, spin, I mean. I don't know. In either way, I think I, at the end, these guys will be destructed, but, or make more. Or do something different. You know, we can. Something that wasn't done before, maybe. Why not? Let's see. Let me just have enough of my paint again. So this one, this one took 355 of uh, paint, a third of a liter and a bit. Okay. Shall I just say that's enough? A lot of white cells, guys. I'm not that that happy. Happy. I mean, you know, such a big canvas. But who knows? Maybe it will add to its beauty. I could. I can also do this. I can, I can swipe it, but why not? I mean, let's just, you know what? Let's just, let's just take these guys. I actually, I didn't actually fix them also very well. Everything is quick, quick, quick. Okay, so now let's just take everything out and spin. So it's, it's totally different than what I see being done. <laughs> but, oh, yeah. Now let's see. All right, so now let's see if with a bit of, uh, I don't know. Oh, oh, oh. You know what? Well, uh, Yeah, they move, which is nice. So first I will just go ahead and, sorry guys, I'm gonna have to tilt this way. You know, I, I just thought I'm gonna tilt. I'm not gonna spin. So I'm just gonna tilt. We will have some negative space, which is nice. Okay, and then I'm gonna go here. I'm going to tilt here. I'm gonna 
go to the, that edge. So you get the cells. Basically, you kind of destruct the cells when you do this. And that's why it's called uh, destructed bloom. So, so next time this guy is going to go, okay, so now I think I will also just take my gloves and deal with everything with my hand. Yeah, baby. Or what? Okay, so which side do we need to tilt more? I should have probably made five to fill it up, but okay. I mean, the white cells now, I don't actually see any issues with that. Look at that. The shine. Oh, oh, oh. don't run, guys, don't run. The shine is gorgeous. What a difference now. I didn't know that. You guys see, right? So I just wanna. It's very important this step of um, stopping the paints, otherwise, you lose your design. And actually, you just do it. don't do it now, but keep doing it. And sometimes come also five minutes later, and if there are drips, you take them off. No. So, so this is it. It's, it's different colors each side, and a lot of, um, like I said, white cells, but the way I see it is beautiful, lovely. You lose that form of shelves, like, you know, they become like, uh, they take every shape because you're taking them left and right. And yeah, so it's my try for a distracted bloom. And um, I, I kind of like it. I actually wanted more of these colors, the green and uh, yellow i wanted this more but i think you know my pigment is a bit um strong so but it gave me a nice here gradation of colors like beautiful and here as well with the green i'm gonna take a picture for you guys you know close up so then you see also the beauty Okay, guys, bye-bye-bye, bye-bye-bye.
Hi again. So after I put it, uh, put the uh, camera off, I thought, you know, I, I decided I'm gonna play with it. That's it. So where I don't have, um, where I can, I will. And then I was like, but it's not fair that you guys see, you know, the, <laughs> I mean, the, the other work and you don't see the rest of it, you know? It's basically I'm combing and I've been combing for a year now. But anyhow, uh, now I've started to use it, using it in blooms. And if I find that it adds beauty, then I will do. Do you hear me guys? Yeah, it's one minute. So I will show you what I have because I mean, you know, you might also decide. Um, so I either use these guys. I don't like to use this part. It takes a lot, at least till now. I never say never. I use this part sometimes, but this is thick. So sometimes if the piece is small, I, well, I use this one. This did the toothpicks and I will show you next time something that I made but anyhow these are the combs I use so this is for like wide like these ones and then I used here this one for the small parts and then I have this one and what I did is I cut every other one shorter so that I have bigger. So then, you know, I have big space, smaller, smaller. And if you want, you can use the toothpick to even the smallest possible. So follow me, uh, follow me. I mean, keep, keep, um, I want to say now. I mean, be in the look, be on the lookout for other videos because I'll be showing other gadgets that will benefit also, like you know, showing um, nice pieces. For example, okay, I look at this here. I mean, why waste that, right? I mean, I like it. So uh, now I have here all these lines that are beautiful. And I could leave them as is, but I mean, my preference is, um, is I want to comp them. I just, it's my preference. So I'm just going to go ahead and this is like just a bit. And, and here. So I actually went in a circle kind of, but why not? Um, so we're good here, we're good here. I don't want to disturb this, it's fine. It looks organic. Then, yeah, this is, this is a very, Yep. Okay, I think that is a uh, way too much. But if I make if this and this and this, then I have to make this as well. I think. Okay, so for this, I have a big distance. All right. And always you have to wipe your, whatever you're using. Okay. 
and always make sure you don't leave a space here so if you find that there is a space wait for it a bit because i mean the paint is gonna get you know um but if you find after a while like now here that there is a spot i just take my toothpick and i try to correct it if i can um, i'm still gonna work on the edges but i mean you know this is really not only destructed but calmed yeah baby <laughs> i love this but okay you know what it doesn't have to be all right i love this yeah i'm telling you okay you get addicted to it <laughs> why not it's your art it's my art right and there is nothing wrong all right and it rhymes it's my art it's your art and nothing can go but right yeah i also kind of want to do this and here i did something that's different <laughs> I, I don't know if I'm happy with that though. Let's see. It came out too much. Okay, so I'm really gonna just. What are we gonna do this now? That's it. I think. <laughs> I mean, I got I got commented on. Uh, I will say this is extreme. Uh, what combing? Not extreme uh, couponing, but extreme combing, 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 comb. I don't know, guys. I want to play with it all. It's not gonna be a bloom then. <laughs> um. Okay, so I'm happy with this so far. So far, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I think, I think it's enough, right? Okay, guys, bye-bye-bye, bye-bye-bye. Again, after we finished, I went ahead and I did more in the middle of, but anything that I don't like, I like to do this with so, so you know it's just me so this is by no means now is like you know uh, going after Karen this is just a disclaimer because she didn't do this you know I like to keep things straight okay so okay guys this is it <laughs> Extreme combing. Bye for now. So it dried nicely. Um, not a single uh, crazing, and I just love the way it dried. And yeah, just that is it, you know. And still, is, I don't know if you guys can see the shine, but it's just here. It's so shiny here as well. Sorry about my nails. And here, but mostly here because the light can also, yeah, and there's more light to, to, to these guys. Look at this high here. And here. <laughs> yeah 
So, this is it. Again.